Welcome to the William Madison Randall Library. From the moment you walk in the front door, Randall Library is here to help. You'll find a large information kiosk in our lobby, which you can use to check and make study room reservations, find research sources, and locate the office of a librarian and more. Another such kiosk is located inside the library at the base of the stairs. Smaller lookup stations are located throughout the library. The circulation desk is the place to check out all library items and the location for course reserve films or books. By the way, on our library website, you can log into your account at any time to see what items you have checked out, renew items, and more. The research help desk is where you can get help with all your research questions. Many of your research needs can be answered here. You can also get research help on the library website by chatting live with the librarian, emailing us your question, or scheduling a one-on-one -on -one research consultation with a librarian. Port City Java is located near the front of the library behind the circulation desk. They offer coffee, smoothies, light lunch, and snacks. Some professors will have office hours here, and students use the space to collaborate, study, and socialize. PCJ has extensive hours, though they aren't open all the time. When you need a snack, you can also hit up the library's vending lounge. Study rooms are located around the first floor. These are rooms where you can meet as a group. Each room has a whiteboard and many have HD monitors to connect your laptop. You can reserve a group study room on the library's website. You can also reserve room 1045, the technology enhanced collaborative space. It contains an LCD projector, a projection screen, sound system, presentation command center, and a desktop computer. This is a great place to practice giving a class presentation. The first floor also features our movie collection, which is organized by genre, comedy, drama, action, etc., then alphabetically by title. If you are having difficulty locating a film, just ask at the circulation desk. FYI, the library also has an increasing number of films that are available to watch online. From the library website, you can go to Find and Research to see what films we have available on DVD, Blu-ray, or streaming online. The new and popular books area is home to a collection of fiction and non-fiction recreational reading. Pick up a book on your way to the beach or when you need a break from studying. Near the first floor restrooms, there is a charging station that allows you to securely charge your cell phone or small tablet when you are away from home. Directions on usage are on the display case. The station supports iPhones and various Android phones. Near the back of the first floor are some special services the digital makerspace is a space dedicated to new technologies, such as virtual reality, 3D printing, 3D scanning, and more. It is open to UNCW students, staff, and faculty. The Technology Assistance Center Help Area, also known as the TAC, can help you with resetting your university passwords and other computer issues. TAC also offers specialized software, including video editing, and this is where you can check out laptops to use in the library. The TAC Repair Service can complete repairs on all brands of computers and can even do warranty work for many computers. The iPrint Business Center is a student-focused business center, providing copying, faxing services, and more. Students can get class materials, group presentations, and handouts copied and printed on a variety of papers. There are two library classrooms on the first floor, one near the middle and one near the back. Most of the rest of the first floor is the Learning Commons, an open, collaborative space for student learning. This space has plenty of computers, printers, and seating where you can meet, study, or just relax. The entire second floor of Randall Library is designated as a quiet area. Please be mindful and respectful of your classmates and keep the noise levels to a minimum. If you need even more quiet, check out our Quiet Lounge, available for any UNCW student with a current one card. There is also a graduate student computer lab slash study room available only to graduate students. Like the first floor, the second floor has many study rooms available, and these can also be reserved on the library's website. Another secure cell phone charging kiosk is also upstairs. Most of Randall Library's books are up here as part of the general collection. These books are arranged by subject using the Library of Congress call number, so just ask a librarian for help finding what you need. Most of these books can be checked out using your UNCW One card, either downstairs at the circulation desk or using the second floor self-checkout station. The second floor also features maps, government documents, music CDs, and a juvenile collection. Again, you can check out most of these items.
Two areas that you will need to make an appointment to visit are our University Archives and Special Collections. The University Archive Collection includes books, newspapers, correspondence, multimedia, art, maps, objects, posters, and more that have a historical value to the heritage of UNCW. Special Collections houses rare books, manuscripts, and other materials that have historical significance to this region. At the very back of the second floor is an auditorium, also known as RL 2047, that is used for classes and special events. Now that you know your way around the library, we can't wait to have you come and visit. Keep in mind that your UNCW One Card is your key to printing, checking out books, and gaining access to Randall Library during our nighttime hours. If you have any questions or issues, please don't hesitate to reach out and ask. We are here to support your success at UNCW.